What is up YouTube? The Arsenal Cycles coming at you. And a lot of times I'm in here and I'm just like, what do I work on? What do I work on? A lot of times it's nothing. A lot of times it's just, you know, cleaning up, organizing. But today, it went like that. Like that. And I was like, when the hell did I get those tires? Those tires. And these are 26 by 175s. I think I got them from uh, one of my friends. I don't remember. I think it was Jared. Gerard. Gerard, if it was you, thank you. So I'm looking at those tires. And I look down. I'm like. And I see those wheels. And I see those tires. And I see those frames. And then I say to myself. Is it time for another parts build? And I say to myself, do I have all the parts? So I hate being in the middle of a build and then having to stop because I don't have all the parts. I don't know if I have a chain. That's something that's gonna hold me back. But let's see. Wheels, tires, frame, forks, cranks, handlebars, coaster brake. This might just work. Let's find out. All right, so first thing first, let's take off the cranks. Real quick, this is why I buy stuff like this. So I bought this whole setup here for five bucks. Originally, I bought it for the forks, which I'm still gonna do something with the forks. I'm not sure what, but I was able to get, oh, this is actually pretty smooth, but it's just ball bearing, so I'm gonna leave it on there. Um, probably take the forks and the rear shock, and then everything else is gonna be trash. Let's get this one out then. Um, so the reason I went with this one, the Montaga, instead of that Panasonic, is because I still have plans for the Panasonic. Do I know what they are? No, I don't know what they are. But I know I still have plans for it. Do not ask me what happened to the other bottom bracket. So I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I'm going to put the new bottom bracket on, which came off the old Schwinn red one. Put some grease in it, and then uh, put the new bottom bracket in. It was stuck, all right? I st stripped the crank. So you just got to go with the new bottom bracket. Plain and simple. Put these tools away. Now, we have all these handlebars here to choose from, but I'm gonna go with these right here because they're already on the stem and I already got grips. 
These came off a build I did with another coworker. Uh, shout out to uh, Anthony Yair. These came off your Centurion. We went ahead and put gears on that one. So had extra handlebars left over. Plus I kind of like the white. Go ahead and get the wheels, which are way up there. All right, guys. This is what started off the build to begin with. The fact that I realized I have those tires. I'm gonna go on these wheels. All right, guys, so as I knew, uh, the chain's not gonna work because it's not thick enough. It's uh, this is like a seven speed chain, and I need a single speed chain, so this is not work, it's not gonna work. So I'm gonna have to cut it. After cutting it. I'm gonna hold on to this chain just in case I need another one. And uh, for right now, I'm gonna build the rest of her and you'll see why in a little bit. So I do have another chain right there on the floor. Right now, we're just gonna put the wheels on. Let's see how she looks. All right, guys, so I'm not sure when I lost you. My GoPro was acting up. So, uh, I think I was putting on the chain, which I cut to size and put a master link, which is, where's the master link? Oh, right there, master link. I put a, um, it's a seat I had handy. And as you can tell, she's, uh, she's done. Actually, it looks pretty cool. I like it. So, I don't like the chain. I think the chain looks kind of funky on it because it's the wrong color. I wish it was all black or just regular color, not the red. The red kind of pops out in a bad way. But that's my opinion. Um, should we do a recap? Let's do a recap. We got, I don't know. We got a 26 inch Mountain Sports Montagna. I'm assuming that's how you say it. Um, teal color, love the color. Black no name cranks with a black no name chain ring on some very uh plasticky pedals you know the pedals look decent at least you know they're plastic but they look nice uh black and red chain which once again i wish it was just a regular chain but it's not so it is what it is uh the wheels this is a, just a regular black hub uh coaster brake with a no-name tan wheel it's wide though look how wide this is uh with a wrapped with a duro 26 26 times 175 i honestly feel like the tires are too skinny for it they bubble out too much but that's just you know if i had some 22.2s i think it would fill up the holes better the the gap better but once again this is what i have it's a budget parts bin build i love those i love like it always amazes me how many other bikes i could build with just stuff I have. Man, I didn't have to buy anything. Everything, all this was in there. Just shows you how much crap I have in there. Literally build another bike with no problem. Um, I did have an issue with the BB. So I changed the BB. I didn't want to, but I had to. Uh, super something saddle, which you can tell has a little bit of wear and tear up here. Um, regular chrome seat post with a uh, single bolt action. It's a mountain sport. Oh, this is also cool, guys. Like, this thing is for the chain guard. I'm not sure I've never seen that on any other bike. I know Shimano has a shark fin that you add onto it, but I've never seen one that's actually in there. Uh, and this is a EX4130 
triple butted chrome molly tubes that's cool uh matching um water cage i was gonna change the water cage for a white one but my wife said no leave it you overthink it i was like all right fuck it i'll leave it then um sr uh quilm with white bars they're kind of dirty but i don't care i don't care uh front reflector Nish team top nut headset whatever that is um matching tubes i'm sorry matching front fork which is kind of cool because it has that same color one of the things i liked about the frame one of the reasons i bought the frame i bought the frame cheap this is like the third time i build this because no one wants to buy it so i take up the parts i build it then i need the other parts for something else so i take them off and i rebuild it so uh let's see so it's just, i bought it because i like the color i thought it would sell fast because the color uh fortunately i was mistaken no brakes in the front no brakes in the back no levers no nothing uh same as the back uh front black hub with a tan uh i want to say these are aluminum because they're fairly light and again wrapped into a duro uh 26 by 175 and that's it guys nice simple build uh i'll put it up on offer up and uh, facebook for 60 bucks 50 bucks i don't know i'll put it up cheap just because I need to clear up room and this is literally all stuff I had. How much did I enter for? I'm in it for under 50 bucks. So if I get 50 bucks, I'm, I'm making money. Anything over 50 bucks, even better. But uh, right now I just wanna clean. I just want, I gotta clean guys, I gotta clean. So for now, hopefully I don't buy anymore and uh, Yard Show Cycles, out. <laughs>